What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. This is your boy Juju the Gamer here on Juju's Anime Corner, and we are back reacting to Date A Live Season 5, Episode 2. Now, the last episode was basically a gearing up episode. It was it was mostly just gearing up. So it was a couple different things happening. The first part, uh, the first main major plot point was who is the spirit of origin? What are um what are Shido's and Shido's and his sister's memories that they lost? And are and even even if they um, uh, <laughs> let me rephrase that. What are the memories that Shido and his sister lost? And are they even able to restore them? That that that's a whole plot point that needs to be thrown out there. But majority of episodes is basically gearing up for this all-out war that Kurumi and the rest of the spirits have against the evil organization that's after Shido's head. Now, with that being said, hit my intro. Let's dive into episode two. Let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> Toka. <laughs> we are we already getting positive vibes. We're getting positive, wholesome, slice of life vibes right now. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's looking like we get we really having about us. Uh, we're having a slice of life episode. That's crazy. What what kind of word game is this? <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, Kagi. What? Hey, yo, yo, what? Yo, Kagi. <laughs> are, are they about to do? Are they, are they about to do flashbacks? They could have just made a group message. You know, four of them have to call at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> this toughest mission? Oh, his mission is just to survive? How will she know that? How will she know that? How will she know that? How would she know that? Oh, so oh, so they're so they're so they're 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 they are really just not about to answer that. Okay. Wow, that's crazy. Y'all fed that to somebody. Pickle wasabi, ain't that hot? <laughs> they gave him one too. <laughs> oh, 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 they they put some absolute bullshit in that in that onigiri. They, they, they did not answer that question. There's some absolute bullshit in that in his onigiri. Oh, we, we, we're just not gonna see him eat the okay. Alright. Just fast forward that. If that's what he used to think, what is he thinking now? Oh, the, the rest of them girls about to get real jealous at Toka for the, for doing this. <laughs> this scene is just pulling the heartstrings, just pulling the heartstrings. But but I I do got a bad feeling that if they're showing heartwarming moments like this, that there's all our war about to be some shit. This piano in the background hitting. I don't know if y'all can hear it, but I, I hear I hear it in the headphones. It's hidden. Are, are these the um the school the the school friends? Oh, that's the spirit siren, ain't it? Has the all-out war finally started? Have, have we hit? Have we hit critical mass? Is the battle finally started? All right. Back from the bathroom. They only have six ships against thirty. Several thousand banner snatch. Okay, yeah. So, so it looks like they they about to go up against a full on army. <laughs> it's about to, it's about to be ugly. But it, it it seems like these first two episodes is really building up the massive amount of war we're about to get, and we still haven't gotten to the part of the original spirit. Cheeto and uh, Cheeto and his sister's memories. So, 
it's it's still a lot of plot stuff we got to get to but first it looks like some ass got to be kicked <laughs> that could work that could work storm the enemy's command well that sucks <laughs> So they really trying to get Beezlebub out the way so they can at least... <laughs> so it sounds like they're trying to get Beezlebub, which is like the strongest... I wouldn't say the strongest spirit out the way. So, so, that they, so that they can really storm and really get shit started. To render the Nibuko powerless, which I believe are like the clones of Kurumi that the other organization made. Yep, they, they, they're going to need everybody. Even though they're trying to protect Shido, they're going to need they're going to need him. Much like how what happened in Naruto on the war. I will say some some of these anime uh background music be so fire. Oh, did they plan for that? Deploying all forces. Oh yeah, so they're expecting to take the offensive. Oh yeah, we 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 about to get some action. Yeah, yeah, it feels like we're not gonna get action this episode. And, and, and this just might be to like the end credits. Like we're gonna get like five seconds of action. But it looks like go time about to happen now. <laughs> we about to get some action. Is that the ship? No, it's Kurumi. Is that CGI? Oh yeah, Kurumi. <laughs> Kurumi lost the offensive. They already trying to deplete them shields. <laughs> How did they pull this off? So all the buildings had, had turns like this? Oh, that was the end of the episode. Oh, 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 wow. I was not expecting that. All right. So it seems like these first two episodes were really, um, were really based on gearing up because the plot has been kind of like really established, uh, throughout the first four seasons, but it seems with this fifth season, these first two episodes, they're really gearing up for absolute chaos. Kurumi has her own army of clones. We have Shido and the spirits along with Katori and the ship. We have the evil wizards. Um, they're all, <laughs> it seems like we're all about to get like a free for all or a giant 2v1. Because Kurumi is trying to protect Shido and the spirits are all and the other spirits with Shido are trying to protect them as well. But it seems like we're gonna get like a giant 2v1 battle with nothing but action these next couple episodes um i'm really excited to see where this is going we did not get anything regarding the original spirit this episode the original spirit we really didn't get anything about it um it's kind of a bummer I, I was really looking forward to see where they were going to go with that plot so hopefully this next episode which is titled the spirits resurrection we get something among those lines but if not, I'm cool if we just get a bunch of action scenes. <laughs> I'm cool with that. I'm cool with seeing the all out war. <laughs> I'm very cool with that. But I, I, I would give this episode like an eight. It kind of drags on a little bit when they were talking about their their, their strategy uh, and their battle plans. Um, and, and the beginning of the episode was more or less wholesome, like, like the calm before the storm, rather. So I, I would give this an eight. I'll give this an 8. Solid episode. Give it an 8. Um, but if you made it this far, please make sure to leave a like. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that bell notification to notified every single time I upload. I'm Juju the Gamer. This is Juju's Anime Corner. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.